in the 1980s, I collected a whole load of children's stories, you know, ch stories that my pupils had written. And I've used lots of them in Racing to English. Well, I've just had some interesting feedback about one of them. It's the one called Angry I Fell in the Road, and it was written by a girl called Rosnara. And what happened was that she and her brother were playing chase, and she chased her brother into the road, but then she fell down and hurt her knee. Went back, her mother put a plaster on her knee, and then her mother hit her brother and said, don't chase girls into the road. And of course, the end of the story is Rosnara says, no, he didn't chase me, I chased him. A nice little story, I liked it. But the feedback was that this teacher was uncomfortable with the idea of a parent hitting a child. Okay, so I had several thoughts. Well, the first one, of course, was if a teacher's feeling comfortable with something I've written, um, I better change it. So I've actually changed it. So now, instead of hitting her brother, her mother shouts at him. And Rosnara says, don't shout at him. But I had lots of other thoughts about it as well. I realised often people moan about lowering um, of standards, of moral standards. But I think in my lifetime, moral standards have risen amazingly. You would never think of hitting a child in a school now. But when I started teaching in 1963, there was a school issued cane in my stockroom. Can you imagine that today? There's so many other things, so, so particularly about child protection and understanding how children can be damaged. So that was my first thought, uh, to celebrate how much we've learnt and how things have improved. My second thought was, I felt a little bit disloyal to Rosnara, because this was her story, and this is a true thing that actually happened. So I, I did worry about changing her story and making it less truthful. But then I thought, it's probably still the right thing to do and, and Rosnara will probably never read it or know about it. Still just have a slight niggle in my mind. But the final thought I had was something quite serious. That we are working to make sure children learn in a safe, calm environment. But children don't always live in safe, calm environments. And there are children in our classes today who are being hit by their parents, who are suffering, not slightly as Rosnara's brother did, but actually very seriously. And we need to remember that there is violence and that children are often at the receiving end of it. Mm.